this whole situation, me moving, and this is that very long <laughs> explanation because it is 5 in the morning right now. <laughs> and my storytelling at 5 in the morning, not up to par, so bear with me. So a couple, honestly, a couple of days ago, maybe about max a week and a half ago, I would say probably about like 10 days ago, we'll say, um, I got an offer to do a TV show that was out of state, which I'm so excited about, so excited to be a part of. And of course, I want to say yes, but it is for a few weeks out of state it's till like, it's like seven weeks, right? seven weeks out of state and i was like yes absolutely and then i was deciding you know what i want to fly back and forth would i want to go in and out would i want to have an airbnb would i want to have a house would i want to have a hotel would i want to have an apartment it was kind of like all up in the air what i was doing i died i had to decide very quick but there's a lot of options Anyways, so I said yes to the project, of course. I was so excited. And then it was time for me to, like, really figure out how I wanted to live, right? And so I was like, you know what? Let's do the apartment vibe. Because I initially was really into a hotel vibe. Because I didn't want to be in a house alone, like, out of state. It's just not my vibe. Then I was like, you know what? Let's do a hotel. But then no hotel had, like, a kitchen for cooking. And, like, it just wasn't the vibe. And so I was like... Okay, let's do an apartment. And so I did my research of the city that I'm going to be in, found exactly where I wanted to live, and then there was an apartment right where I wanted to live, and then there was a nice apartment right where I wanted to live. It just, like, all stacked up. Here's one I need to find this perfect new little first living out of my home town. Like, what? I don't know. Like, this is the 5 a.m. story that I'm talking about where... Brain's not fully functioning, but we're making it work. <laughs> Long story short, today I am now, right now I'm in Florida. Uh, I came down here because my parents were down here, uh, my brother's down here, and so I was coming down here just to visit with everybody before I go to where I'm going. And then today I go, I get my car there, I have a truck, which I'm so excited about. I've always wanted a truck, so I got my, got my truck there. And then I'll go get my apartment today. I do orientation today. I do, um, I, all my furniture comes today. And I'm gonna go to the store today, buy like bedding and towels and stuff. I did a pickup order of like trash bags and Clorox wipes and like that type of stuff. But stuff that I wanted to pick out, I'm gonna go to a bunch of different stores, see everything, take pictures of everything, and then like decide what I want from where, and then backtrack and go get it all. Um, gonna go pick up my new drum set today. So I have a drum set in this city at this um, apartment. Got a sick e kit. Oh my god, I'm so excited about it. Uh, uh, pretty much, it's pretty much the situation. In the last like four or five days, I've learned so much about leases and renters insurance and utilities and it's crazy. Being an adult, whack. Like, I, I mean, I guess I've, like, I've been an adult, you know what I mean? But, like, I don't know. It's just, there's, there's so much to it. Don't grow up. All been really good, though, and that kind of worries me a little bit because normally, like, my ducks are not in a row. Maybe I have a chicken. Like, I don't really know what's going on. But I feel like right now, like, all of my ducks are in a row. Everything's going smoothly. I have everything that I need all been really good though and that kind of worries me a little bit because normally like my ducks are not in a row maybe i have a chicken like i don't really know what's going on but i feel like right now like all of my ducks are in a row everything's going smoothly i have everything that i need i got all the information like what is gonna be wrong what is gonna come tumbling crashing down so fast because everything is going way too smooth it is too good to be true something is going to shit today and i don't know what it is let's hope it's nothing but something is all right that's where we're at right now now i'm going to go walk around the airport got my suitcase got myself my backpack and then my water um that i need to fill up make dinner dilemmas disappear with i need to 
walk around. I board in like 15 minutes, so we're chilling. And then, yeah, get on the plane, get there, go get my car, and then it's freaking go time. So, obviously, you're seeing these videos now, and then I'm going to film all day long, all my adventures, everywhere I end up. Um, and truthfully, I'm probably just going to keep filming for a few days and then upload all at once so you can come on the journey with me um or i might upload them all tonight stay tuned for that it's honestly going to depend on like how tired i guess i am because i i'm running on three hours of sleep from tonight and then two hours from last night so woo! Tired, just, just a little bit. I did take like an hour nap at some point yesterday, but it doesn't really do much. So it's going to depend on my tiredness and like I got to kind of kick it in high gear when I get there. I have a few days to get settled, but I got to like get settled fast because I'm going to start working um, pretty, pretty soon while when I get there. So got to kick it in high gear.